has and will always play a big role in people's lives. After all, one wouldn't be able to survive without it. Today, with the advancement of technology, it has aided us in the progression of the techniques and equipment used for the food we know today. So then, what did the people of the Edo period eat? Ama coming from amai meaning sweet and natto meaning fermented bean. Ama natto is a Japanese traditional sweet made of adzuki or other beans that is cooked in a sugar syrup then covered with sugar. They were made in early 1860s toward the end of the Edo period 1603 to 1868 by Yasube Hosoda. Hosoda's original store Ietaro Sohompo can still be found in Shibuya, Tokyo. However, after looking at the website, it looks like they have stopped selling amanato. Dango is a sweet rice cake, mochi, made from a glutinous type of rice. There are many different types of dango, some being bochan, goma, and mitarashi, to name a few. The earliest known beginning concept of dango is said to be in the Joman period and was made with nuts. However, the dango that is known today is from the Muromachi period, but only became widespread and popular in the Edo time period. In fact, it is said it was a time when the popular saying, Hana Yori Dango, which translates roughly to, to enjoy the dumplings more than the cherry blossoms. It is important to remember that rice played a huge part in Japan's history. The importance of rice was so high that it was a system of taxing, jomen, and shaped Japan throughout its history. Throughout the Edo period, as stated by Thompson from Metropolitan Japan, there were many yatai or small mobile food stalls which served ready meals. For breakfast, they would serve dishes like dried fish, boiled beans, rice, and fried tofu. However, the Edo period was most known for the Four Kings, which were soba, eel, tempura, and sushi. In the Edo period, Sushi was considered fast food for the common people. Stands or yatai would have been put up on the streets to sell these humble delicacies. Edo was where the first concept of sushi was created. At its beginning, it was hand-pressed balls of rice topped with fruits of the sea, known as Edo Mae Sushi, literally in front of Edo Sushi. Eventually, this food would evolve into today's nigiri. This sushi was also two to four times bigger than its modern bite-sized version. Additional well-loved dishes of this time included loach, nabe, anago, miso, and oden. Japan being an archipelago, seafood is commonly eaten. These include, however, not limited to shellfish, sea cucumber, bonito, squid, saba, salmon, tuna, and eel. And stated from Cartwright's from Ancient History Encyclopedia, even if the fish cannot be eaten fresh, it would then be transported inland, dried. Soba. 
a dish once only known as temple food, becoming widespread in the Edo period. Some popular soba includes kiri soba, a shorter noodle, which supposedly makes the noodle easier to eat in crowded establishments, soba gashi, soba flour dumplings, and soba hanamaki, which is topped with torn nori sheets. Edo style tempura differs from that of Western Japan. It is cooked in a mixture of vegetable and sesame oils rather than the just plain vegetable oil done in Kyoto. In this way, the heavier sesame flavor stands up to the richer, more pungent taste of the seafood used. Whereas Kyoto tempura largely focused on vegetables and is served with just salt, Edo style tempura was often served with minsuyu, a Japanese soup base normally used in soba and udon dishes. The delicacies of the past is what built a structure for foods of the future. Amanato, Dango, and the Four Kings continue to hold Japanese tradition, but also evolving and adapting to modern times. You can find these delicacies throughout Japan, and we hope that you get a chance to try them.